Okay, welcome back to this final step of this section, which is all about tracking your traffic, okay? And um, in this final step, we want to set up a conversion pixel, okay? So this might sound like gibberish to you, especially if you're just starting out, but if you follow the steps, it should be pretty easy to implement, okay? And it, you will benefit a ton because you will know how people are converting. And the conversion rate, by the way, is a very good indicator of how good and how targeted your traffic is, okay? So if you run two tests of two solo ad vendors, okay, for example, and one has a conversion rate of 30% and the other has a conversion rate of 17%, you know that the first one converts better. So you get more bang for your buck, of course, okay? And you gotta know that unless you're just throwing money out of the window, if you do paid traffic. But this is also great for tra free traffic too. Now, um, let's go and create a new custom tracking link, okay? So you wanna go to tools, and go on tracking pixels and you wanna hit the pixel builder um, section, okay? Now, we want to create a custom pixel just for us so ClickMagic knows who converted and who didn't, okay? So what do you want to track? We wanna track actions. Conversion attribution is always last click, okay? Do you want to track dupl duplicate conversions? And you wanna uh, leave it at no, okay? So we don't want people who put in their email address twice to show up as a second uh, conversion, okay? Because it will ruin our numbers. Then, are you adding the pixel to a secure HTTPS page, okay? And in, in our case, since our uh, uh, secret affiliate machine runs on ClickFunnels and they always have an HTTPS, a secure page, we want to change this to yes, okay? Are you adding this pixel to a tracking link? No. If you want to add an optional refer value, enter it here. We don't want to do that, okay? Now, here you want to go and hit JavaScript down here and it will generate this code, okay? So you want to go ahead and highlight it and Command C or right click and copy, okay? And we want to go back to ClickFunnels into our funnel, okay, ClickFunnels, Funnels, you wanna open up your secret affiliate machine and you wanna to go to where it says edit here because that's the second step of the funnel, right? Right after people put in their email address. And you wanna go ahead and go to edit page and all the way here where it says settings on the left side, you wanna to go to tracking code, okay? Click on tracking code and you wanna to go to the footer section. So don't put it in the header section, go to the footer code, okay? And there's a, a already a pixel installed because um, you know it's my shared funnel, you got it from me. So this ClickMagic pixel code is my own click pixel code and you wanna change that, okay, to your pixel code. Unless my stats get gets met, messed up and you won't track your conversions, okay? So you can delete all of these, delete it, and paste in your own um, tracking link that you just got from the tracking builder, okay? You wanna just paste it into the footer section of the second page of your secret affiliate machine. Now, if you did that, you can close down and save it. That's very important that you save it, okay? So the changes are applied to your site and to your funnel. Now you can exit, okay? And now we can run a simple test, okay? we can run a very simple test. We're gonna go back to Click Magic, go to links, and sometimes it needs a little bit of time for the uh, tracking code to get embedded into the website. So it might not show uh, if I try to show you now, but um, let's just try it out. So you have your links, okay? And you go to the link we just created, or the one you created. In our case, it's the traffic for me tracking link, right? You wanna copy this, right click and copy and you want to open up a new tab and command V paste it in there and hit enter and as you can see you will uh, be directed to your very first page of your secret affiliate machine okay so now you can put in like a test email something that you know just make up something you can put in your own email whatever it's just for testing purposes and you want to go and hit submit and move to step number two so you submit it 
and there's the second step of your secret affiliate machine. Now, this basically, we just simulated someone coming to your website, coming to the first step of your funnel, and then we simulated them putting in your, uh, their email address and moving on to step number two. Now, let's check if um, ClickMagic picked up on that, okay? Because sometimes they don't, but as you can see, if we refresh everything, um, close this down, you can see we got an action over here, okay? So you see the total stats, I clicked on it three times, uh, that's total clicks, and then there's unique clicks, so based on each IP, and since I clicked uh, on that link only, it shows one unique click, which is me over here, and then it shows one action, because we just submitted um, our email on the first page. So uh, ClickMagic now knows, okay, one guy came to the first page and one guy made it to the second page, which uh, concludes to a, con a conversion rate of 100%. Now, of course, that won't happen because, you know, as you drive traffic, some people won't put in their email, but you will always see the percentage of how, what percentage of people go from uh, go on to move to step number two, okay? So um, that's basically it, that's all we need um, for now. Now there's an advanced thing if you wanna implement that too, which is creating a custom tracking link for your ClickFunnels affiliate link, okay? So what you can do is go ahead and go to ClickFunnels, go to edit here, okay? Because you remember we put in your affiliate link into that section, okay? onto this button, we, we switched uh, my affiliate link out with yours, okay, so that you get paid commissions once somebody makes it to step number two and, and signs up. So you wanna go here to set action, go to website URL and copy your affiliate link, copy it, go to click magic, go to create new link and name it click funnels affiliate link clicks. Okay, then you're gonna create the custom URL, click funnels affiliate, okay? And important step, you wanna in the primary URL, I'm sorry, uh, in the primary URL, you wanna put in the uh, your affiliate link we just copied from the button in your funnel, okay? You wanna paste that in here, okay? And you wanna create link. Now it created that link, okay? You wanna click on that link, grab the tracking link you just created, copy it, Command C, go back to your funnel and change your affiliate link with that tracking link. Put it in right in here where you just copied it from, okay? Put it in there, go somewhere in the background and very important, hit save, okay? Hit save. Now go back and exit, okay? and go, if that tab is still open, to the second step of your uh, machine, okay? So you wanna go into ClickFunnels and click this button right here under edit here, okay? So we'll open up the second step, and as you can see, if you click your button right here on the very left-hand side, it will show the uh, ClickMagic traffic uh, tracking link we just created. And if we click on this, okay, it will open up the the um, uh, short signup page for ClickFunnels, okay, which your visitors will click on. Now the cool thing is, since we clicked on it for testing purposes and go back to ClickMagic and refresh, okay, it will show us a unique click for the ClickFunnels affiliate link, custom tracking link. So you can see who and how many times your affiliate link inside of the SAM funnel was clicked by whom, okay? Because you see the location, the um, you know operating system, and the device they clicked on, okay? So you kind of get an idea of, if I send 100 clicks, for example, with traffic for me, and 30 people convert, that's a 30% conversion rate, and out of those 30 people, maybe 20 clicked on the ClickFunnels affiliate link, okay? So you further down the line, you see how many people clicked, okay? So that's it for tracking, my friends. And um, in the next section, we're going to dive deep into traffic, 
paid and free and I'm so excited for you that you're now ready to go. Everything is set up. Your funnel is set up, click funnel is set up, your emails are set up, the autoresponder sequence we talked about, uh, your tracking is in place. So now it's time to hit the ground running. And um, you know, there's there's so many ways of getting traffic. And don't worry if you don't have the money to spend on traffic, because I have a bunch of cool ideas and methods how you can drive free traffic to your secret affiliate machine. So I'm excited to see you there. And thanks for sticking with me. And yeah, let's go to the ne next section.